It's Sunny and Finn's Wrestling and Video Game Podcast. This week, we discuss WWE Roadblock, and that's pretty much it. Merry Christmas! What's up, guys? Welcome to episode 44 of the Sunny and Finn Show. I'm Sunny, and with me, as always, is Finn Steele. Hello! How are you feeling? Better, I think. Better. Better. That's better than last week, and that's better than <laughs> Sunday when I saw you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm, do- I'm doing better. I'm on the mend, I think. On the mend. I hope. That's good news. Yes. We good need a, uh, a clean bill of health for 2017. Here <laughs> we do. Definitely. For sure. Definitely. Yes, How are you? I'm okay. Yeah? Yeah, I'm good. I feel good. I'm ready for... Um, I'm ready for Christmas break now. Oh, yeah. I've been back at work three days, and I'm already sick of the office. <laughs> so I just want to... Uh, I've got some games I want to catch up on over Christmas, some stuff that I started... So sort of earlier on this year and left alone. Yeah, nice. Um, got a few films that I want to see. I've got to see Star Wars. I still haven't seen it. Of so, uh, yeah, I'm ready for break. Uh, awesome. I'm ready for 10 days off. Nice them. Working in retail, you wouldn't know about this. Uh, yeah. Well, I've got two weeks off from my birthday, which is uh, beginning of January. So, uh, that'd be nice. Wait, Make your birthday's it. in December, is it not? Nope. Oh, January. is it in January? Yep. Okay. Uh, January the 9th. To be January true. the 9th. Yes. There you go. So, if you need to send <laughs> gifts, yes. at least you know when to do it. <laughs> January the 9th. That's it. Is that y- what day is that on this year? Uh, it is a Monday, I believe. A Monday. Yes. Is there a pay-per-view on the Sunday? There's not, is there? Because the next one's Raw Rumble, right? Uh, yeah, that'll be the end of January. Okay. Yeah. We'll still do a stream on the Sunday. Anyway. Yeah, sure. We'll do it. Sure. <laughs> um, got some stuff to talk about today. Okay. Uh, nothing much in the way of gaming news. Yeah. Right. Mainly some exciting things. Hmm. Let's start with some thank yous. Yeah, okay. So, um, we started this pretty much a year ago today. Yeah. Um, and we've just kept going throughout the year and we've had a great time. We have. <laughs> uh, we've met some cool new people, mm-hmm. uh, both on social media and through YouTube. Yep. Um, we've had over 24,000 views on our YouTube channel. <laughs> crazy. Which is crazy when <laughs> you think about it. 16,000 of those are from, uh, <laughs> <laughs> from <Toyota. laughs> Which is the uh, craziest thing to happen in 2016. Yeah, seriously. In the whole world. In the whole world, yeah. Yep. Um, the po- people listen to the podcast. It's great when I get, so when we get messages from people who, oh, I listen to the podcast and, you know, like, and sort of, you know, follow with something. And that's yeah, really that's cool. Very awesome. Um, so thank you to everybody who has supported us this year. Yes. Um, big thank you. It has meant a lot to us and it's given us the, uh, inspiration to not only keep going, but to, to grow. Yes. To grow into bigger and better things. Yes. Um, and starting in January, mm-hmm. uh, we're going to be expanding. Yes. Um, we are launching Daydreamer Gaming. Mm-hmm. Okay. So what that is, is um, it's a platform for people who, for streamers like ourselves and other people, whether they're sort of been doing it for a while or whether they're just starting out. Yeah. It's basically so we can all come together under one umbrella and, you know, for example, uh, there are people who watch uh, Finn and I who don't watch sort of other people, Mm. but it'd be nice for those other people to get the same exposure that we do and vice versa if they have people that don't watch us. Yeah. So we're going to pull our collective efforts together uh, under one bracket. Um, Everyone's still going to have their own channels. But we're also going to have a a Daydreamer channel on YouTube and probably Twitch as well because people do like to stream to Twitch, yep. especially if they have an Xbox One and can't stream to YouTube, which is stupid. Very stupid. Fix that, please, Microsoft. Yes. <laughs> I can't believe that's not a thing, to be honest. Uh, I can't believe you can't stream bizarre. to YouTube from Xbox One. It's so bizarre. But um, it's something we're very excited about. It, it is ambitious, but um, it's something that I really do believe in. I think it's going to be good for everybody involved. Yeah. Um, and we'll start to throw out a few more details uh, in the new year, but it's going to start in January and it's going to be very, very exciting. Yes, good stuff. Got some people already on board and Excellent. some people that you already know, possibly. Maybe. Um, Gaming Mule is going to be a part of it. Yep, yep. Podkins has expressed interest in creating some football FIFA content for us. Excellent. Which means I haven't got to do it, which is <laughs> great. <clears throat> Everyone loves FIFA. Everyone loves FIFA. On YouTube, anyway. Yes. <laughs> so <laughs> that's exciting. 70. And that's that's the beauty of it. There's going to be so much different content because everybody's different. Yes. Like we are predominantly WWE stuff and we do other random things on our channel, but people 
come to us for the WWE 2K stuff. Yeah, I think so. So, you know, and then Mule will do his thing. And, you know, the other guys who are going to be involved, they'll do their thing. There's going to be a lot of different content and it's going to be all in one place. Mm -hmm. Um, So, yeah, we'll be brought to you by Daydreamer Gaming coming January. Yes. Or starting in January. Starting January, yes. This is the Sunny and Finn Show, and we are a weekly video game and wrestling podcast that posts every single Friday mm-hmm. across podcast services everywhere. Everywhere. Throughout the world. <laughs> Worldwide. Worldwide. <laughs> Finn. Hello. What have you been playing this week? Um, more of the same, really. More Final Fantasy, more uh, Last Guardian. Um, honestly, I think that's the only two I've been played this week. Okay. Yeah. Um, still... Are you enjoying Final Fantasy? Still enjoying it? Yes, loving it still. It's been early today, in fact. Um, it's so good. How far in are you now? Um, still not that far in. I've been doing so many side quests and stuff, just getting lost in the world and stuff. Um, to go on the hunts. And yeah, just just move on to the next story segment, and then that unlocks way more <laughs> side side content. Oh, so right, I'm going okay. back around and doing all the other stuff. Um, what so, chapter are you on? Uh, three still. I think oh, the, three. Yeah, I think one. Oh, okay. Of, I, think I was going to ask you three. if you got to chapter thirteen yet, because apparently oh, it's. Uh, <laughs> And then shit gets real. Oh, apparently it's not... doesn't <laughs> no. make sense when you get to 13. Oh, okay. And they're patching it next year, because they've got to record all the languages that the game's in. Mm. Um, they're going to... Apparently it stops making sense at this point. Right. Weird. So, obviously, I know that they, they did the film, mm. and there's some of the stuff the that anime. ties in with it. Yeah. But it doesn't make sense to the game if you... Like, for me, for example, if I... Oh, Apparently, I see. if I got so, to chapter 13, I'd have no idea what was going on. I get it. So if you haven't seen the movie and the anime and all that other crap, then yeah. you wouldn't know what it has. Yeah, that which, makes sense. which, to me, um, is wrong anyway. Yeah, it's a bit dumb. Because, um, I, I mean, I, I'm not going to go out of my way to watch. I mean, I'm sure it's great. And I'm sure the anime is fine as well. But I don't have time. So if I want, <laughs> yeah, I, I exactly. want the story to be in the game. Yeah, yeah, me too. I, I've seen the movie. It was fine. Um, I've seen, I think I've seen the first couple of episodes of the anime. I haven't seen a whole lot, so... Maybe we'll catch up on this. I don't know. Because I don't but want to I, get there and then it, the characters be like, oh, I remember this. And I'll be sitting there like, no. Yeah, I know. Like, I know <laughs> what do you mean? mean? Yeah. What is this? Yeah, for sure. That is a bit weird. So, but they are patching it out. They they realise that this is sort of a, an issue so that it, the, uh, a patch is coming next year. Good stuff. Which Good, next year it. isn't very far away. So, yeah, exactly. Um, uh, I think a big patch dropped for it today, actually. It did, yeah, actually, yeah. I had to download that. Um yeah, that and WWE 2K17 uh, patch, the massive 18 gigabyte patch. Uh, <sighs> For God's sake. Yeah. It's, it's getting ridiculous now. I've never, never known a WWE game to be so broken like this. <laughs> I know, it's like so many patches and it still barely works. <laughs> the notes were outrageous again, though. <laughs> they were. Uh, like, the only like thing, I, 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 I didn't even read all the stuff it fixed. I was like, you know what, forget just, it now. Yeah, like, I, I, I'm, I'm happy with it broken just just stop messing around you, <laughs> you 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 fix things and then break things at the same time so what's the point yeah and i am um, all i took from it was that the future stars pack is basically coming next cool works for me and i'm fine with that um last guardian then mm-hmm. um week two with the last guardian yes and uh, do you like it anymore or have you yeah have, as what i said about it last week <laughs> dampened your spirits a little bit no i'd still do i still problems with it obviously Convincing Tri- Trico to do stuff is still annoying. I mean, just kind of sits there and kind of spins around in a circle 27 times. It's like, no, I need to jump up the thing. This lady there pointing towards it. It's like, no, jump. He's just like, <laughs> um, <laughs> But when a game is good, a game is good. Um, yeah, just to keep uh, more, more, more puzzles keep opening up, more, more mechanics and things you can do. Um, so, yeah, I like that. I like the more stuff is uh, coming into it. Okay. And uh, How far in are you? How much have you played, do you think? Um, still think I'm that far in, probably about five, six hours in. Okay. Um, so you've got about four hours left. It depends how much you... Yeah, ex- I think so. I mean, I don't think there's much to explore because it's not open world. It's very yeah, linear, yeah. isn't it? So. It is, yeah. There's trivia for being, for being in five hours, so it can't be that long. Um, oh, there is, isn't there, actually? Yeah. yeah. Trophy list is garbage, by the way. It's, it's so bad. Um, <laughs> Have you unlocked many trophies? Not any yet. Zero percent. <laughs> it's it's dumb. What, after playing for five hours? Uh, yeah. It's like, there's one for beating the game, uh, a few more for beating it in under a certain amount of time. Uh, and this other stuff is all like optional stuff you probably wouldn't figure out on your own uh, unless you're looking up a guide or something it's like it's like feed all the, all the barrels of Trico and yeah Sony must <laughs> not listen or people like cause this is an, an in-house game yeah they must not I listen know. to the moans of gamers <laughs> trophies matter they do we've been moaning <laughs> about this all year trophies matter stop giving us garbage trophy lists yeah I mean I, I think my favourite trophy list of the year has been Witcher 3 um, it's like 
but it's, it's, pretty, it's pretty much doomed. Wait, did that come out this year? No, last year. Sorry. Okay. Blood of Wine came out this year, I think. I don't know. My brain's not working. Okay. <laughs> but yeah, my favourite favorite list of this generation, let's say, which is because it basically just do everything. It's like, do all the things you would do anyway. And you get the platinum trophy. So it's like, that's good. That's what I want to do. Okay. Except for like one, maybe one trophy, which is like, get sort of many headshots with, with the bow, with like a crossbow, which you wouldn't do anyway, because that's not actually a thing. I don't know. It's weird. But for the most part, it's a really good list. And yeah, more like that, less like uh, Last Guardian. Fair but enough. I do, but I do like the game. It's good. What's, what was the point we're making? <laughs> well, I asked you if... Uh, I'm not sure. I, I, got, I, I, I wanted to know if you were enjoying it anymore. Uh, yes, I am. Okay. It's a short answer, yes. <laughs> yeah. So that's all you've been playing? Pretty much. So, so, how about you? Um, well, I haven't really been playing playing much. I've been playing a lot of um, PES 2017. Oh, yeah. I've been getting back into it. I've been playing the... Um, so FIFA has Ultimate Team, mm-hmm. which is massive, the, the biggest mode. Even I've people, heard of it. Why people play it, basically. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Um Pez does have a version of it. It's called My Club, and I've been getting really into it. I've been playing a lot of online. Mm. Um, I've been quite good at it as well. So I thought, cool. well, I don't want to stop playing it and yeah. then you know come back to it and start losing matches. I need yeah. to keep my momentum going, but it's kept going and kept going. So mm-hmm. I've been getting promoted through the divisions, and I'm like, nice. what the hell is going on? Like I wasn't. <laughs> I don't think I was this good at pro before. <laughs> yeah. But apparently now I am. Excellent. Uh, which is good. Um, <laughs> I started Virginia yesterday. Oh, what's that? Uh, no, you not one. seen Virginia? Don't think so. So it's an interesting game. It's like a, a an indie. It's like a, it's an indie title basically, mm. and uh, there's no talking in it. The characters don't talk. Okay. Um, it's it's like a it's like a thriller, like a crime thriller. Oh, so right. you're you play the role of uh, a female police officer, or no FBI agent. Okay. And um, you see everything through her eyes, and then you see how this case develops. Yeah. Um, it's really interesting. I'll show you it later things, on, yeah. actually. But yeah. uh, the art style is is awesome. Yeah. Um. And it's the way it's done is it almost follows the music. Oh wow! That's in it. So like cool. it's like playing to a like a TV, it's playing out like a TV show. Yeah. Obviously, with just with no dialogue, so you have to sort of understand what's going on in the story from how the characters react and what scene is now happening. Yeah. So basically, um, the sto- the I mean, I've only done a little bit of it, but um, the story is like a, a boy's gone missing in Virginia. Okay. So you're now trying to figure out what's going on. I see. And it's very, very cool. It's, um, yeah, it sounds really cool. The Platinum is achievable. 23% of people have it. Oh, great. <laughs> so uh, I think it, I think it takes a couple of playthroughs, but it's not a long game. It's like a four four or five hour game tops, I think. Nice. But it's... Um, I really like it. Uh, yeah, I love sounds... the art style and the, the direction of the game is different to stuff that I've played before. Yeah, sounds sounds like a bit up my alley. Yeah, you'll. I think you'll like it. Yeah. I'll show it you. I think you'll like it. Cool. Okay. But other than that, I've not really been playing uh, a great deal, to be honest. There's so much I want to play. <laughs> yeah. like, going back to what I said at the beginning of the podcast with stuff that I've sort of left behind, um, I need to play the final two episodes of Batman. Oh, yes. Because uh, the whole thing's out now. Excellent. So now you can play it also. Yay. <laughs> um, uh, I want to go back to Ratchet and Clank, and I want to oh, finish yeah. that off, because um, I played loads of that, and then stuff was just coming out. <laughs> games were just coming out of my ears. And I'm yeah. like, oh, oh, Ratchet and Clank, later, later. <laughs> Right, so I'm going to go back to that, and uh, I want to play through The Walking Dead Season 2 that you let me, oh, yeah. because the new season's out now, and I want oh, to yeah. play through I've seen people playing it, and I, I've i got that game of jealousy, where it's like, well, I want to play it as well. <laughs> yeah, I'm still waiting for the uh, board games to come out, as always, Yeah, uh, sure. but I do want to play it. <laughs> so I think uh, Episode 1 and 2 came out together, I want to say. Uh, that sounds right. I think that happened with the first two game, two uh, seasons as well. So, yeah, makes sense. Um, did you play Walking Dead Michonne as well? Uh, I haven't played that one. I think that's more based on the TV show, and I haven't watched the TV show. So, oh, is it? Yeah. I, so. I know Michonne is a character in the TV show. Yeah. Because Lottie watches the TV show. Ah. So, yeah, uh, I saw that and was like, oh, why don't we watch the TV show? So, probably not for me. Okay. So, yeah. Okay, fair enough. I don't think it's going to affect anything that you've played. I don't, I don't think so. I think Clementine's anyway. story is like separate to everything else. Okay. Great character, by the way. Clementine. Yes, it's great. Excellent. Um, but there's no gaming news this week. Yeah, not really. Slow, slow couple of weeks for gaming news. I mean, Christmas, Christmas is in like that. four days' time. Yeah, so everyone, everyone's got their news out before before Christmas, and yeah. like nothing's happening. So, so <laughs> um, we may as well move on to the wrestling side of our podcast. Yeah, sure. So we've talked about what we're playing. We've revealed our plans for next year. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, let's talk about let's talk about the wrestling. Let's start with start with the uh, roadblock and the line. Yes. Nailed it. So smooth. Nailed like, it. Straight away we nailed it. <laughs> Thank you to anybody who came to our stream uh, oh, for yes. Roadblock. 
Thank you. Probably one of our most successful one, successful ones yet. Yes. Uh, surprising, to, considering it was just crappy old roadblock. <laughs> it was under the line. There's nobody cares about. A little bit disappointed <laughs> that you didn't say under the line when I said thank you for coming to roadblock. Ah, oh, shoot. Sorry. I missed it. Damn. Rewind. Rewind. <laughs> thank you to anybody who came to our roadblock. End of the line. Prediction show this past Sunday. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> and then... It was all those things that Finn said. Yes. I it was very fun. I learned that bit out and then, yeah. <laughs> nah, I don't know. <laughs> no, yeah, it, it's, it's the fun of the podcast. It is. <laughs> uh, fun times. Good so, times. So, uh, Roblox. Damn, we missed it. Uh, oh, no, no, wait. <laughs> so, <laughs> Roblox. End of the line. Bit shit, wasn't it? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think much to it, no. I didn't think it was very good. <laughs> yeah, it's a bit... A it was a raw pay per view. It's like every time there's a raw pay per view, we're like disappointed at the end of it. Yeah, the rumor is they're gonna maybe drop them, drop like brand exclusive pay per views next year. Oh Let's really? Get back to doing yeah, apparently from the rumors. I don't know how sure it is on this. Oh, sure, okay. How true it is, but we'll see. We'll see in the new year. Uh, but for now, Roblox. So the kickoff show had Big Cass versus Rusev, and uh, because of Enzo's dick, because of Enzo's penis, and it was a match that happened. Um, Rusev won by count out after I think Lana distracted him by pushing Enzo or something I didn't watch it um, <laughs> so yeah um, Sunny said Rusev would win I said Big Cass so that's one point to Sunny right now 1-0 ding by the way our bets are all tied up so it all comes down to this we need to end of the line <laughs> yeah uh, Sunny 12 Finn 12 so it all comes down to roadblock end of the line <laughs> yes yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I like that we've managed to drag this out for another week <laughs> yes <laughs> yeah, so good um so then the first real match of the night. <laughs> real match. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> first real match. Actually, actually pretty good. Probably the match of the night, actually. Uh, it was a New Day versus Sheamus and Cesaro. Baby. Baby. And uh, yeah, it was really good. It um, was good, yeah. I enjoyed it. Yeah. Uh, plenty of New Day shenanigans. Uh, desperately trying to keep hold of those titles for next week or next month. Um, but shockingly, um, uh, Sheamus and Cesaro won. Yep. Which I don't think anyone saw coming. No. Um, yeah, we both had both had new day to win that. It seems um, a little bit yeah. ridiculous to me <laughs> that they've had new day break that record, and then <laughs> seven days later, yeah. they've took them belts away from them. Yeah, they could have dragged it out a bit longer, couldn't they? Um, I mean, they could have at least made it look like it wasn't just Vince trying to get back at demolition. <laughs> yeah, at least give them a month, give them to the Raw and we'll have them lose them there. Yeah, what's the next big pay per view? So what I think is going to happen here is um, new day will have their rematch at the Raw Rumble. Mm-hmm. And then not win, obviously. Yep. And then Seamus and Cesaro are going to a program with somebody else. Yeah. Um, that that I, th- I, I don't think they can drag this out for a, a long, long time. Yeah, I don't think so. Um, yeah, great match. If you haven't seen it, I recommend going to watch it because it's easily the match of the night. Yep. Um, and yeah, do we good? We both had New Day. We did, yes. So no extra points there. There's still one nil to Sunny. Just because we just we couldn't see New Day dropping <laughs> the title so soon after they broke the record. Yeah, it just seemed yeah. But, you know. Seems to be a trend developing here. <laughs> Who else doesn't Vince McMahon like that has a record? Because <laughs> yeah. obviously, AJ was married to CM Punk. Yep. So that got broken. That, so Nikki Bella broke that record <laughs> yep. and then lost the belt very quickly. Yep, that's true. Um, Demolition sued Vince McMahon, or at least <laughs> tried to. Um, I don't know how successful it was. I think don't it was care. Successful. Yeah, don't care. Um, so New Day broke their record mm-hmm. and lost the belts very quickly. Yeah. Who's next? Who's next? <laughs> uh, um, so yeah, next match was uh, Sami Zayn versus Braun Strowman. Ah! Uh, yeah, with a 10 minute time limit. Good impression there. Yeah, perfect. <laughs> um, <laughs> so yeah, Braun dominated this whole match pretty much. Um, mm. Which is, I guess, fine. Just, that did have to be Sami. We like Sami. Never For some reason, Sammy. we didn't know there was a 10, 10 minute time limit on this until we did the stream on Sunday. Yeah, I think they added it in later or something. I don't know. And I, I think wasn't paying attention. We'd that. have probably both had the same. Uh, we we would have probably both had um, different predictions for this. Should would we have known that? Yeah, I think yeah, it would have been more obvious. Um, yeah. Um, but yeah, so uh, Mick Freddy came down halfway through just with a towel in his hand. Go on, throw in the towel. He looks like shit, by the way. He doesn't look great, does he? Yeah. Yeah, he looks terrible. <laughs> um, I'll save that for when we talk about Raw. <laughs> yeah. Um, and you've had a request. I'll talk to you about it later on. Oh, okay. Um, so, yeah, it was a fine match. Sammy survived the 10 minutes. Um, hit, a, hit, 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 yeah, hit him with a hula kick. Uh, just wiped the time out. And, uh, yeah, Sammy kind of won, I guess, because he beat the time out. Yeah, I, I mean, <laughs> I don't know why that 
means he won. Yeah. But, um, you know, WWE logic. Yeah. Sammy wins because he survived for 10 minutes. Yeah, bizarre. Um, Is that a new thing? I, don't know. I guess so. But okay. So I said Sammy would win. You said Bourne would win. So that's a point to me. So it's one all. Ah, okay. All tied up. Um, so that brings us to Seth freaking Rollins versus Chris Jericho. Uh, and it was, a, it was a fine match. Not a kind of okay match. Nothing amazing, but sure. he was fine. Yeah. Um, Kevin Owens came down to try and help. Uh, ended up costing Jericho the match. Because uh, Jerry had Seth rolled up, but the record distracted with Kevin Owens. Uh, so that was the whole thing. Um, and yeah, then Seth ended up winning with a pedigree, and that was kind of it. Kind of okay match. I wish Seth wouldn't use the pedigree anymore. Yeah, same. Um, not, not the way he does it. He kind of grabs hold with the arse and like, pulls it towards him. It's a bit weird. Very forceful. <laughs> it is very forceful. Very forceful in a, a sexy way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but no, yeah, it's strange. Grabbing by the arse. <laughs> Throw his head in between your crotch. <laughs> yeah. Just be giving, giving back to the curb stomp. There's nothing wrong with that. Well, I mean... I, mean, I, I, get, just... I get you don't want to have kids curb stomping each other in the playground and all that. But still, come on. Yeah, but you don't it's want real. kids pedigreeing each other in the exactly, playground Exactly, yeah. Either. It's still just as dangerous. Ugh. WWE. Yeah, so. I, don't, I mean, I understand the bans on, um, you know, pile drivers and maybe stuff yeah, like that. Stuff that, that although you do have a, a degree of control over it, you still don't. Yeah, Things still, can happen. Yeah, you're still dropping someone on the head, which is not a good idea. Yeah. With the curb stomp, I mean, it's, <laughs> it's, 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 it's a timed move. Yeah, I mean, and someone's... it's not like he's actually... No, the better person is just putting their head against the floor. Yeah. It's like he's not actually you know, stepping on the head. I had a good conversation with somebody on Twitter yesterday, actually, about this. Oh, yeah. And um, we were talking about... Um, we were talking about Mick Foley. Hmm. And we were saying how, you know, what he's like now and stuff. And we were saying that you know, I'm. We're sort of glad that the big bumps aren't really that much of a big part of the program anymore. Yeah, me too. Because especially when you see Foley now, yeah, and what he's what he's like, uh, you can sort of see why things change over the course of the year. So you can see why pile drivers have been banned. Yeah, you can see why people aren't getting thrown off cages and at least not so frequently. Yeah, yeah. I mean, bloody hell, it happened twice in that one match. Yeah, that's true. And you know, Mick Foley took so many other ridiculous bumps, and you can see why. They've tried to phase these things out over the years and why wrestling has developed. Um, I don't think the crowd has developed with it because the crowd still expects so much more, especially live crowds. Yeah. I think sitting at home crowds understand. Yeah. But people people there, like they don't get it as much. I guess. Yeah. Yeah, I see what you mean. Um, but yeah, it makes sense. But yeah, I'm with you. I'm glad I don't think any more like, crazy big spots. You don't need to. No, I never like them. Um, so yeah, the next match of the night was uh, Cheat AP versus Brian Wait, Kendrick. What do we have in the predictions? Um, so we both had Seth to win. So it gives us both a point. So it's two all. Still tied. Still tied. Still tied. <laughs> so yeah, next match, uh, Cheat AP versus the Brian Kendrick versus Rich Schwann. This was not as good as it should have been. Agreed. It was a bit... So annoying. A bit lame. Um, one cool thing was Austin Aries was there on commentary. So Yeah, I love that. Cool for that. Cool team on the main roster. Yep. Um, so yeah, kind of fine match nothing amazing no I know and it's such a, yeah. such a sad thing as well because like the cruiserweights really need like, a good showing the yeah. crowd don't care as it is and that, <laughs> which is annoying enough it is and this again goes back to what I've just said about crowds not they, they expect too much yeah but like, they want flippy flopping all, like, all, the, all the time and it just can't happen map based wrestling is part of wrestling yeah it is um, but this was disappointing I'm really rooting for the cruiserweights but if they're going to deliver like this, then what's the point? <laughs> yeah, a couple of weird moments. Uh, like one point, TJP had, uh, I think, Swan in a knee bar. Then he went to the ropes, but it triple threat match and no rope break. But then he broke anyway. It was weird. Um, and the commentary made it obvious as well. That yeah, they obvious. sort of cocked it up a little bit. Yeah. Oh, there's no disqualif- There's no rope break or disqualifications. TJP doesn't have to break. And, yeah. But they broke like up. it's a normal wrestling match and it's like, yeah. uh, awkward. Maybe these things should be discussed before you go out there. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. But one cool thing to come up with this match uh, was after the match. So which one won? Um, which you both had in your bets, so it's another point to both of us. Yay. Uh, and then Neville came down. Uh, all smiling and happy to congratulate. Seemingly to congratulate his uh, friend, which one? Who apparently they travelled the world with and had friends in Japan and all that. Um, but of nope. Course. Yeah, of course. But nope. <laughs> um, it's kicked him straight in the face. And uh, heel turn. Big, huge heel turn from Neville. So unexpected. Um, so, yeah, and he kicked the shit out, out of him and uh, TJP. 
And yeah, cool to see a new persona from Neville, a super angry um, Geordie. Yes. <laughs> um, I thought this was awesome. Yes. It was great to see Neville anyway. He looks like he's trimmed down. Yeah. Did you think that's where he's been trimming? I mean, <laughs> does anyone care about the 205 weight limit? I know it's called 205 Live, but are they really enforcing it? Um, I don't know, maybe. Who knows? But um, he looks like he's trimmed down. Um, but I love that he's turned heel because yes. what, he, what he was doing before, although, you know, it's cool to us, it's cool to, it's cool to see. Yeah. But it doesn't really give him any depth as, in character. Yeah, he wasn't, yeah. He's, 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 nothing. I mean, no, he's talking, when he, when he speaks, it means nothing. Yeah. Because there's no depth to his character. But now he's got that, um, you know, he's a heel and he can be angry and now he's got real depth to it. Mm-hmm. Um, and this is awesome. I'm so happy that he, both, that he's back and going to be doing stuff on TV. Yep. Uh, and that he's in the cruiserweight division yes, uh, as well. Very cool. So uh, this is going to be awesome. Um, and I think we could get some really good matches out of Rich Swan and uh, Neville. Yeah, me too. And Neville and other people as well. It doesn't <laughs> yeah. have to be restricted to just those two. Yeah, seriously. But yeah, uh, that's really, really cool. And, and yes, you are right. Uh, not only was that the best part of that match, it was actually possibly the best part of the whole show. Possibly, yeah. Definitely. Um, so yeah, cool. Good stuff. Uh, then we have uh, Charlotte, uh, Charlotte Flair versus Sasha Banks in an Iron Man match, and it was fine. <laughs> it was slow as hell. It, yeah, it was. Um, it was slow. It was. It was. Um... I felt like we've seen this match before. Well, that, I think that's the problem. When, <laughs> yeah, just was... like when Kevin and Sammy were fighting so many times, you like uh, you just felt like you'd seen it. Yeah, or, you know, there's only so much you can reinventing of you can do with somebody yeah you can only sort of do so many new things and then at the same time you can only do the old things so many times um but it was it served its purpose i guess <laughs> yeah um so i've got the pause there where was it um oh yeah so charlie got the first fall with like a natural selection from the top rope um she also got a second fall with some sort of very sloppy looking wall up thing um, <laughs> <laughs> and then uh, I've been down I think oh no Shasta got a third fall with the bank statement um, Charlie got the fourth fall with the last two seconds of the match with like a figure eight um, it's kind of dumb because you've already held on for that long why tap out in the last two seconds of the match WWE logic uh, yep yeah. it brought the score to 2-2 so it came and went into like a sudden death um, Shasta got busted open during the match like bleeding everywhere um, unintentionally unintentionally of course yeah um Charlotte counted a figure, uh, bank statement into a figure eight, and Shasta Banks tapped, so Charlotte won back again. So it's like a four-time champion now. Uh-huh. <laughs> I mean, uh, not only, I mean, this is ridiculous. It's a bit. I mean, I called it. I yeah, mean, I you, had Charlotte. Yep, yeah, you had Charlotte. I had Shasta. So it's four three to you. They're trying to. I mean, and they mentioned it again on Raw. They they are going to try and keep this pay per view streak alive. It's yeah. going to be a thing. It is going to be a thing, isn't it? Yeah. Um, I don't like that the women's title has been used like this. I understand mm. that they've got to um, sell both of these women and that they are both as good as each other. Yeah. But you don't need to switch the title all these times to do that. It's like um, like on Raw, um, like Bailey challenged Charlotte and like, I've got your number. Mm-hmm. And so, you know, Bailey didn't win the title to prove that she, she could beat Charlotte. Yeah. And it her. worked perfectly. So... The fact that they've yo-yoed the title or bounced the title around so much is annoying, mm-hmm. but I think it'll stop now. I hope so. <laughs> uh, I really hope so, because it it cheapens the it cheapens the title. It does. Um, so yeah, I'm glad it's finally over. Um, it wasn't as good a match as it could have been, but yeah, as you said, it serves purpose. And it's fine. Yeah, and the the rivalry is now thankfully over. Yes. So now we thought that about Sammy versus Kevin, but they <laughs> fought on Raw and they never mentioned that that last time they yeah. fought and the time before that and the time before that. So. But to be fair, enough time had passed, so it didn't feel better than when it actually felt like a good match. True. So, so yeah. this has been pay-per-view after pay-per-view. Exactly. <laughs> ad nauseum. So I'm glad it's over um, and I'm glad something new is going to sort of begin for both mm-hmm. ladies. But it has been great. It has been a really good rivalry. Probably, yes. should we say, are we going to say rivalry of the year? Um, yeah, I think so. I can't think of anything else that uh, last Sammy versus long. Kevin this year? Yeah, I think, yeah, we think it'd be a toss-up between the two. Yeah. For sure. Uh, and I enjoyed AJ versus Cena as well. But I, yeah, I think absolutely. Charlotte versus Sasha, just for what it's done for women's wrestling. Yeah. And um, how it's brought it to the forefront. Uh, I think for that alone, I think it's been... I think that's the rivalry of the year. Yeah, I agree. That makes sense. 
Uh, so, so well us- done, ladies. Yes, well done. Um, that brings us to our main events. Uh, Kevin Owens versus Roman Reigns for the Universal title. And it was, again, another fine, okay match. <laughs> Just average medium. Uh, yeah. I'm bored <laughs> of this shenanigans endings to championship matches now. Yeah. Um, um, I just don't think it should carry on. I think, I mean, I know Roman didn't win, but he should have won. <laughs> yeah, it was a weird, weird ending. Um, so Jericho came down at the end of the match. Uh, looked like he was going to attack uh, Roman, but uh, hit a crowd got on Kevin Owens. Like, oh God, it's finally turned. They're no friends anymore. And then because he kind of smiled and handed him the title. And like, yeah, we did it. So because Kevin, Kevin Owens ended up winning the match. Uh, by DQ, and that was the plan all along. They're all still friends, yay. Um, sigh, sigh, big time sigh. Um, <laughs> yeah, I'm. I, it's just annoying now. Yeah, it's getting to the point. It's funny. Is it still funny? It's funny to see like Kevin Owens and Chris Jericho do their thing, but it is, and it's, it's I, I like that stuff. Yeah, but it shouldn't uh, interfere with matches. Um, no, um, it's, anymore. <laughs> I don't know. I'm, but it's just what you come to expect now. It's like we we could have. I mean, I I did say Roman Reigns, but you know, you could have sat here and been like, "Well, Jericho's probably going to interfere in some way." <laughs> yeah, um, and probably oh, I don't know. It's just uh, another <laughs> Raw pay per view where we're coming out a bit pissed off. Yeah, it was cool point. to see uh, Seth Rollins and Roman Reigns beating down um, Owens and Jericho after the match. Yep, a couple of chill power bombs with some tables. That was yeah, cool and all, but. You know, I, d- I don't understand what happens next. I know they're going to fight yeah. the Royal Rumble or whatever, and Jericho's <laughs> going to be in that shark cage to promote that toy. Yeah, buy our, our toys. Yeah, buy <laughs> our toys. We're going to do it in real life. It's going to yeah. be amazing. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. I don't. Yeah, I'm. I'm also past caring now. Yeah, same. It's that point, it's like, ah, oh, who cares? Yeah. Um, <laughs> to be honest, I'm at a point where I want Roman Reigns to win the title. I was at the, that point before Roadblock. Yeah. Just yeah, this is something different. Yeah. Mm. Um, so yeah, so you had uh, Roman Reigns to win, I had Owens, um, definitely Owens won, so I get a point for that. Um, so so this year ended in a tie, 74, win four. <laughs> but no, we can't, we can't end tie, we've got, we've got to uh, finish it one to four. We have, yeah, we, we need to do something yeah, to... I, th- um... I think we need uh, Super Lucha versus The Ultimate Steel, 2K17, okay. no disqualification, four score anywhere match. I was going to suggest <laughs> Iron Man. Oh, I know. Yeah, that worked. That worked too. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We'll do that. Okay. That sounds good. Okay. <laughs> I can't believe like we were like roadblock end of the line is gonna <laughs> it's gonna end our predictions and there's gonna be a winner. <laughs> Finn's either gonna have to get the platinum for Oli Oli or I'm gonna have to play Persona Four on Vita. <laughs> and then it's a draw. And we're like, oh. oh, come on. <laughs> uh, um, Al, what would you give your high school grade to roadblock? Um, like a D minus. Um, the new day versus Simmons and Zara is cool. Everything else is kind of average. Yeah, I'm going for I'm going to give it a, an E. An E, okay. A big E. Big fat E. Yeah, I, is... I didn't enjoy it, and it just annoyed me. It got to a point when I was watching it, and I was thinking, I can't be bothered with this. Yeah, but same. It's like another raw pay per view, another anger inducing raw pay per view. <laughs> yeah, another disappointment. Yeah. All right. So moving forward. Yay. We move on to raw, um, which wasn't that bad yeah um, it was a tolerable show it was fine I know that we sound like we moan about wrestling every week but when <laughs> you've been watching it as long as we have it's, it, it gets, becomes tiresome yeah it gets predictable and it's like yeah, uh, it's, yeah there's the ne- three hours. there needs to be a more of a spark in 2017 as far as wrestling is concerned yes I but agree. you know we don't have, we still love wrestling we yeah. still come back to it every single week regardless of how crap it is <laughs> yeah absolutely so let's uh, let's talk about Rawfin okay it started off, as you said, with uh, Jericho getting locked in the cage because uh, they want people to buy the crappy toy. Um, and Jericho gets to get a height, apparently. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> it's, like not, it's not like he's ever jumped off a uh, steel cage onto people before or he's anything like that, but or... he's terrified of a... Or been in ladder matches, yeah. done a Wars of Jericho on top of a ladder. He's never done any of that before, no. Uh, but he is scared of being in a shark cage for the sake of selling toys. Uh, yeah, apparently so. Um, so yeah, set, set up a match for Royal Rumble, which is going to be uh, Roman Reigns versus Kevin Owens, with Jericho suspended in a stupid cage. Sure. Or some what somewhere. was Mick Foley wearing on Raw? <laughs> I don't know. Some terrible Christmas uh, jumper thing. And the leather jacket was terrible. Yeah. That was bizarre. Like they said, oh, he looks like he's dressed like the Fonz tonight. Yes. Is he? <laughs> the Fonz was mid-50s and looks homeless. <laughs> yeah. 
Um, you've had a request this week. Okay. For the podcast thumbnail. <laughs> All right. Um, from a from a friend of mine, he said, um, if your podcast thumbnail isn't Mick Foley, photo, Mick Foley's head photoshopped onto Tom Hanks from Castaway's body, <laughs> I'll be disappointed. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. Thanks for that. <laughs> so you, you, so you're even getting requests now for your famed thumbnail work. Okay. Why Tom Hanks on Castaway? Oh, uh, we, we were talking about it because he looks like a bum, basically. Uh, okay. He's lost. He's like lost a lot of weight very quickly. <laughs> yeah. You've seen Castaway, right? Yeah. Where else? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Seen. Um. Yeah. So Big Foley looks like a bum. Okay. So it's like Tom <laughs> Tom Hanks. Um. Caught three quarters of the way through Castaway. <laughs> cool. Okay. I'll I'll see what I can do. Good times. <laughs> um, <laughs> Our thumbnails have been amazing this year, by the way. Oh, thank you. It's been okay. Last one was a bit rushed because we had to do it in a single day. But <laughs> yeah, we recorded and got it out in one day. <laughs> yeah, impressive. That's impressive. Even that's impressive even for you, Finn. Thank you. <laughs> um, so yeah, uh, first match of the night was a rematch. Uh, Big Cass versus Rusev. Uh, nobody cares. Big Cass. <laughs> got, <laughs> Big Cass got disqualified because he beat a punch Rusev a bunch. Sure. Uh, yeah. Whatever. Yep. Let's fly through this. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so then Shasta Banks came down um, saying he wanted to do a thank uh, Shasta for all the feud and saying congratulations, Charlotte. Charlotte. Yep, that's the one. Um, but uh, Charlotte didn't come down. Instead, we had Nia Jax. Um, so Nia Jax and Shasta are going to be feuding now. Fine. Yes, I'm good, good with that. Fine. I'm Happy. fine. It gives, <laughs> it's nice to see Nia doing something good. Yeah. And it's good to see Sasha not fighting with Charlotte. So yep. I'm all for this. Um, and I'm excited for that going forward. Yep, me Next. too. Next, um, Seamus and Cesaro got some new belts. Um, what do you think of the new belts? I like them. They're better than the old ones. Yeah, uh, I didn't like the the like the bronzy ones. I thought yeah, it was a bit weird. A bit weird. Um, so yeah, basically it's a red strap with silver. Basically the SmackDown titles, but red. And um, yeah, it's fine. Do you think they turn AJ's World Championship blue? <laughs> I hope not, but probably. You can see it. You can see it, can't you? <laughs> Definitely, yeah. Because obviously the women's title is blue as opposed to red. Yeah. I don't want them to because I kind of like the black and gold design. Yeah, I do. It's traditional. I like it. Yeah, but you can see it. You can see it. I can definitely see it. Yeah, for sure. Um, He'll lose the belt to Cena. <laughs> Cena will get the uh, the yeah. new. Uh, he comes back next week. <laughs> he does. Yeah, as long as the belt doesn't spin, I'm fine with it. <laughs> <laughs> God, I hated that title. It's like when terrible. when they when it span initially, I was like, okay. <laughs> yeah. But then when everyone else started to have that same belt, I was like, yeah, no, 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 no. Sense. that belt's a terrible design. <laughs> It's funny for the first like couple of weeks of Cena having the belt. Yeah. But now it's weird. It is a bit weird. Now you've all, now you've got CM Punk holding the belt up and it's like doesn't spin or nothing, it's just crap. Yeah. Dumb. Dumb. Um uh, and Braun, Braun Strowman came out and killed some people. Um backstage. Uh, he killed uh yeah, he threw back he destroyed backstage. <laughs> yeah, yeah, threw some people around, threw over some tables and stuff. Um it's like go home, Braun, it's fine, Sammy's not here, just bug off. Yeah, I've <laughs> given Sammy. Uh, I told Sammy to go earlier on today. He's two hundred miles away. Like, How fast is he traveling? <laughs> yeah, seriously, he took a jumbo jet. Yeah, it's, 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 <laughs> the red arrows came and picked Sammy up, <laughs> yeah. and they took him away. <laughs> <laughs> He's now two hundred miles away. So, <laughs> uh, weird. Um, Sammy took thrust two home. He was parked in the car park, <laughs> yeah. and he land speed record all the way. <laughs> uh, so then we had um, Alexander versus Dar in a, in a short but cool match. Uh, one of the few cruiser matches of the night. Um, Alexander ended up winning. Uh, but Dar, after the match, said, oh, I want Alisa Fox because she's really pretty and whatnot. Um, I like this. Yeah, uh, I, I was initially annoyed at Noam Dar losing. Yeah. But then after the match, when he started talking, I was like, okay, I'm I'm good with this because yeah, I'm going um, it forwards this story. Like having him win and that's it, that's that's crap and pointless. Yeah. But having this, the feud carry on after by Noam Dar talking, um, I like that a lot. And yes, Noam Dar, I can't say it enough, is a superstar. Me great, yeah. <laughs> the crowd, the raw crowd doesn't deserve the cruiserweights. <laughs> Seriously, Neither yeah. Neither does the crowd on 205 Live. Put them in full sail, let them have these feuds, because 205 is really starting to come together now. Yeah. I mean, my friend were talking the other day, and we were like, this could be the like the, the show to watch in 2017. Yeah. Because, be. like, this isn't for the title, but you, 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 you know, you still care about it. Because it's Cedric who's awesome and Noam Dar who's awesome. Yeah, and awesome exactly. as a heel because he's an arrogant little prick. <laughs> yeah. I like that. Yeah, it's great. Um, so okay. I'm, I'm, I'm all for this. I'm, I'm really excited. I, don't, I know it's over Alicia Fox or whatever, but That's fine. it's, it's still fine. Yeah. I like it. Um, uh, good stuff. Uh, so New Day come down and uh, to congratulate Seamus and Cesaro, uh, or, Sh- or Cesaro, not Seamus, <laughs> but, and, uh, 
<laughs> the club interrupts, uh, Anton Gallows show the, the uh, shining stars, uh, fight ensues, and then after the break there's suddenly a match going on with uh, the club and shining stars versus the New Day and Sheamus and Cesaro. <sighs> Ah, uh, is- yep. Yeah. <laughs> Mick Foley made this during the break. It's like, what? what? Did they? Okay, cool. Sure. <laughs> it's like, what do you? Th- I like the chemistry between Sheamus and Cesaro. Yeah, I do too. Uh, I like the sort of the back and forth on the mic. Um, it needs work, but uh, I like the chem- the chemistry's there. Yeah. I just think the back and forth needs a little bit of work because um, it's it's a little bit. Um, what's the word I'm looking for? I don't know. Um, you know, like <laughs> C- Cesaro's quite quiet yeah and he's like Seamus is really good but Cesaro's responses are a bit like mumbly into the microphone a bit like this and yeah I see what you mean yeah yeah but it needs work and it you know the chemistry's there and it will get better I'm, sh- I'm sure of it yeah um, I like the Shining Stars yeah I do um, they're my favourite <laughs> tag team on Raw <laughs> nice just to be different just to be different <laughs> and because like uh, Ep- uh, Primo like danced to the entrance music when they came out <laughs> yeah and I, like the, I want one of the leaflets yeah same <laughs> but uh, so I like the Shining yeah. Stars and I like the club even though they uh, uh, Luke Gallows wears way too much fake time yeah that's true and why does Carl Anderson wear trousers now oh yeah no do they think he's maybe got crappy non muscly legs is that what this is <laughs> maybe maybe just want to match I don't know who knows um <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Yeah. Uh, then we had some cruiserweight thing. Um, didn't make a whole lot of notes on it. Uh, that said, angry Neville is ang- angry and kicks the crap out of TJP and Rich One. Yep. Well, Brian Kendrick just sits down and watch, watches. That's what was funny. Yeah. And then uh, Brian Kendrick did slice bread number two. Oh, yeah. Um, on the fallen TJ Perkins. Yeah. It's good because, like, uh, yeah, Neville just was really angry. Yeah. And then um, Rich One came down. Keep clicking. Like that. Uh, Rich one came down. Uh, they had a nice little back and forth. Then Brian Kendrick came down, and then TJP came down, and Neville literally knocked him out straight away. Oh just, yeah, that's really funny. And they just sprinted to the ring and they suddenly thwack. So, so they're making Neville out to be quite un- like unstoppable at the minute, which yes, I like. I like that a lot. Yes. Um, good, good, good. Next week we're probably going to have Brian Kendrick and Neville versus TJP <laughs> and Rich one. Yep, I was about to say that. Yeah, or maybe <laughs> on two hundred five live. Or maybe yeah. I haven't seen it. Have you? Not yet. No. Okay. What might have happened? It happened already. Um, uh, let's just say Austin Aries is back on Raw again. This, uh, is back oh, yeah. on Raw as well as being on uh, Roadblock. Yes, excellent. So Good. that's awesome. More okay. exposure for Austin Aries because there is he's definitely going to come on to into the Cruiserweight division. Oh yeah, for sure. Um, and when he does, it'll be awesome because the yep. crowd will already be sort of familiar with him by seeing him on Raw, mm-hmm. especially if they don't watch NXT. What are you doing if you don't watch NXT? Yes, yeah, seriously. Um, but yeah, good stuff. Um, yes. I like the Cruiserweight division a lot as. You could probably hear over the last few weeks. <laughs> yeah. Um, then we had the match everyone's been waiting for. Uh, the Ultimate Fighter, Sin Cara, yep. versus Titus O'Neil. Oh my God, what a match. What? Oh. <laughs> Titus O'Neil doesn't know what he's he's got himself into. <laughs> yeah, yeah, seriously. Like, I was I was so excited for this. <laughs> Didn't know it was happening, but I was excited for it anyway. Any appearance of Sin Cara on Raw, I'm like, okay. <laughs> yeah. This is, this is what I want to see on Raw every week. Yeah, same here. Sadly for us, uh, Braun Strowman... That pesky little rascal oh. came down, interrupted, <laughs> <laughs> and beat the crap out of him. Um, what Braun doesn't know <laughs> is that when he he's going to get what's coming to him. <laughs> yeah, if not, he... but you know, in the form of Titus O'Neil, that enormous person. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. It's like the Ultimate Fighter. Oh yeah, yes, Sin Cara. Braun Sin is coming for you. Yes. You can throw Christmas trees all over him, <laughs> throw <laughs> him into all the presents. Yeah, Sin Cara cares not. He'll be back. He will be back. <laughs> With a vengeance. Yeah. Uh, and then we had uh, Charlotte versus Bailey. Uh, Bailey saying, I've got your number. I've beaten you twice. And then she beat her again via a backslide. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, good. Which they seemed few... to debate after the match. Was Charlotte's shoulders really down and all this sort yeah, of stuff? Yeah, kind and... of, I guess, secondly. But, yeah, whatever. Well, yeah, whatever. Um, I'm fine with this. Yep. Another, I think... another new feud. Yeah. Oh, and a much needed new feud. Yep. Bailey won't win the title just yet. I still think she'll win it at WrestleMania. I really do believe that. Yeah, I think you probably won't. Um, but I think uh, we're going to see Bailey get the crap kicked out of her mm-hmm. badly by Charlotte one week. Um, Bailey will come bounce back. Uh, it's going to be really good. I'm excited for it. I like yeah. I like Bailey a lot. The crowd like Bailey a lot, which is important. Yep, yep. And Charlotte is uh, again the best that they've got. Yeah, and okay. she's come a long way in a short time, and that's awesome. Yep, good stuff. Uh, then we had the main event, which was uh, Kevin Owens and Chris Jericho versus Roman Reigns and Seth freaking Rollins. Yeah. <laughs> keep calling that. Um, uh, it was good. 
decent okay match until Braun Strowman, the pesky rascal, is back oh, again. Ah, him again. Ah, oh, how dare he? <laughs> <laughs> he came down, laid waste to laid waste to uh, Roman Reigns and Seth Rollins. Cool. Uh, Chris Jericho and uh, Kevin Owens just kind of uh, rolled out and mm. hid. <laughs> yeah, they threw Roman back in. Oh yeah, they did, didn't they? Yeah. Um, Do you think so, this yeah. is gonna, uh, when uh, I saw this going on? I was like thinking him like in just. Do you think this is going to sort of trigger off maybe Braun versus um, Roman for the title? Uh, I, that was my first thought, thought as well. Um, great minds think alike. Um, yep. <laughs> yeah, possibly. Hopefully. That'd because be then way to that get takes that belt off Roman. Yeah, exactly. Uh, yeah, that'd be good. I'd like to see that. And but it'll brings, have to happen before the Royal Rumble. Yeah, definitely. And plus it elevates Braun Strowman to like a more uh, main eventy kind of level. Or at least gives him... Sp- a reason to destroy people instead of <laughs> yeah. running in at every single match and just killing everyone. Yeah, exactly. Um, yeah, uh, I'd like that. I'd like to see Braun with that US title. Yeah. And um, it could lead to interesting things. Yeah. I Good like stuff. Braun a lot. Uh, more than I ever thought that I would. <laughs> yeah, same. Um, so yeah, and that was Raw. Okay, let's move on to SmackDown. The mediocre Raw. Um, so yeah, SmackDown was... Fine, yeah, fine as well. Uh, so the first match of the night was uh, AJ Styles versus uh, James Ellsworth. Uh, full of title. Match is finally happening. Yep. And uh, AJ punched him once and that was it. <laughs> Sent him match spin number three. And uh, yeah, AJ retained. Shocking. Thank God. Thank Christ. I thought that's a good way to do it as well. Because like, he shouldn't have a chance and he should it's get down way. Yeah, exactly. It makes sense. Finn, what happens to way, uh, James Ellsworth once this program of his is finished? Um. Well, late in the night he got Carried away by uh, Carmella. Um, so that's going to be a thing. So what are going to enter him into the women's division? <laughs> Maybe. Uh, who knows? It's, uh, I'm done with him now. I am as well, but he signed a WWE contract and I'm yeah. curious as to what happens with him. I mean, fair enough that he signed a WWE contract. They've mocked him every single week he's been on TV. Mm-hmm. But now the title program, you know, this whole thing with him and Ambrose and Styles is starting to wind down now. Yeah. So what's next? This is a tiny little guy <laughs> in a big boy's playground. Yeah, seriously. So what next? Yes. I'd like, you know, if he's going to be around, fine. But what's he going to do? Yeah. Going to be like a no hornswoggle idea. type role or what? Mm. I have no idea. Yeah, who knows? He's making um, his money. He's, he's having his 15 minutes of fame. Yeah. Um, or maybe he's had it. Maybe, maybe he's had it, yeah. Um, so yeah, he got beaten up after the match by AJ, obviously. Um, yeah, that was the thing that happened. Um, oh yeah, Ziggler came down as well. Um, said they're going to have a match next week on the last SmackDown of the year. Who was that, sorry? Uh, Dolph Ziggler. And then Baron Corbin interrupted saying, I should have been the one to be the number one contendership. Agreed. Agreed. I agree yep, with I agree. Him, yeah. yep, me too. I wrote it on my notes. <laughs> <laughs> um, so the match was made for that night. Uh, Baron Corbin versus Ziggler. If Ziggler loses, then Baron Corbin will get his title shot instead of Ziggler. Uh, yeah. Sure, which is the be- which would be way better. Agreed. <laughs> so Ziggler said he wanted to fight AJ for the title next week on SmackDown. Yes. So that's his title shot. Yes. Okay. Because uh, apparently they can't. They want to have to get that out. out, out, out. He didn't mean to say they want to get that out of the way before the Rumble, and then have something else for the Rumble. I guess. Good. Yes. Good. <laughs> Very, Very good. good. Good decision. Absolutely. Providing it happens. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, so then we had a match: uh, Apollo Crews versus The Miz for the IT title. The Miz. There is. Apparently, Apollo beat him on the uh, tribute to the troops, which is why he's got a match now for the title. Congratulations on being on TV, Apollo Crews. Yes, well done. Tribute to the troops. Has that been on, is it? Apparently so. I know, like, we <laughs> talked... Oh, actually, we talked about it last week, didn't we? Because we talked about TJP. Oh, yeah. So it must have been on somewhere. Can you get it on the network, or...? Shrug. Sure, I don't know. <laughs> no, it's too much wrestling to watch anyway without that. <laughs> yeah, seriously. And nothing events. I mean, I'm sure it's great that they go and do it for the army or whatever, but... Oh, yeah. In fact, isn't it even in America now, just in an arena or something? I think so. Something like that. <laughs> Who knows? Um, yeah, so Apollo Crews on top most of the match. Uh, good showing for Apollo. Uh, Maurice tried to get tried to get uh, involved, but got ejected. Um, the referee got blown over by a gust of wind. Um, so it couldn't, so <laughs> missed both of in the eye when he wasn't looking, and then hit with the score quitting finale for the win. And yeah, that was fine. Um, then Renee Young came down uh, and asked Miz about Dean Ambrose. Saying, "What's your obsession with Dean Ambrose? Why are you obsessed with him?" And then Miss turned around and said, what's your obsession with him? You're the one sleeping with him. Oh, snap. Well, she, yes, he said them words. Yeah, yeah. And Renee slapped him in the face. And 
yeah, what's talking smack? Was that the, the uh, pointed out? I think. <laughs> right. What's talking smack? Um, I was sort of hoping we were going <laughs> with an Apollo Crews Miz program then for the IC title, but it certainly nice. looks like we're going to have Dean Ambrose versus the Miz <laughs> for the IC title. Yep. <laughs> that's going to be a thing fuck's um, sake interesting they're bringing Renee into storylines um, yeah. uh, I, I really like Renee yeah she's but, cool uh, but I'm happy with her in her current role I don't yeah, think same. she needs to um, be am- amongst it yeah I don't think so but um, but she's she's more in the spotlight now because she is on Talking Smack and all that sort of thing yeah so. we're on Total Divas as well isn't she Divas Divas uh, <laughs> I've done that in a few weeks no we haven't no <laughs> at least not mid yeah uh, mid podcast <laughs> Total Divas. Divas. Um, so we had uh, Natalia come down and call out uh, Nikki Bella. Uh, Nikki came down without the bum wiggle, which is saddening. This is terrible. It's terrible. Terrible news. What? Did her actual entrance? Yeah, well, did, didn't they? Just kind of storm down, kind of looking all grumpy. Oh, okay. Yeah. As long as they've not removed it completely from her entrance due to health and safety. Or <laughs> this or is, yeah. It's not banned like the pile driver. <laughs> yeah, no. That's the day I stopped watching them. <laughs> uh, yeah, so Kamala interrupted uh, this whole thing. And basically convinced Natalia to uh, confess. And Natalia's an idiot and confessed. And was like, I'm a heel now. I would beat you up. A heel so, now? She was a heel before, wasn't she? I guess so, yeah. I don't know. So it was Natalia who did it all along? Yep. Surprising. Shocking. How kind of very surprising. Surprising and disappointing. I got hoping for like some sort of swerve and have it like be Eva Marie or something. You give but, WWE too much credit. I do. Yeah. Uh, so that's going to be a feud. <clears throat> Nikki Bella versus Natalia. Fine. Sure. Whatevs. So we had uh, Luke Harper versus Dean Ambrose. Uh, Called to Luke Harper. Uh, Dean ended up winning with some sort of fancy roll-up thing. And then got immediately beaten up by the Whites. It's like Bray and Randy came in and kicked the shit out of him. Mm. And then <laughs> after that, he's left, just kind of left playing in the ring. And then the Miz came down and picked him up and hit him in the squad with the finale. Just for lols. And just, <laughs> just for lols. <laughs> yeah, just didn't mind everyone that they in the feud. Um, <laughs> and then we had uh, Alexa Bliss versus um, some female luchador. Who definitely wasn't at least uh, Becky Lynch. Definitely, definitely not. not. Nope. No. Definitely not. Like no. Her. Same no, 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 no. Didn't sound like her. No. Didn't do the disarm her or anything like that. Nope. 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 Not her. Um, so she ended up winning with some sort of weird armbar thing from behind. Oh, mm, okay. It's awfully familiar. It's, a, it's an interesting move. Yeah, must, interesting. Uh, must, must have learned them in the mean <laughs> wrestling rings of Mexico. <laughs> Absolutely. What, um, wasn't it Luchadora? Something like that. Luchadora the Explorer. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Uh, but then she took the mask off and oh snap it was Becky Lynch all along no no way <laughs> who knew <laughs> who knew <laughs> uh. yeah you big kidders <laughs> <laughs> uh. you had us all fooled <laughs> uh, so yeah they're going to be having the title match next week as well on the final episode of Smackdown of the year okay so that's going to be the big yep. Smackdown isn't it it is yeah that's cool yep fine with it totally fine um, next match we had was uh, Mojo Rawley um Versus Kurt Hawkins, because, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> because why not, I guess. Face the facts. <laughs> yeah, face the facts. Oh, man, I was so excited for his debut, and then he just kind of, uh, nothing happened. What? It, uh... It's like this Emelina thing. Exactly, yeah. It's, it's like they, they picked him up and like, yeah, he's coming next week. Then he wasn't there. Yeah. And like, Emelina's like, oh, she's coming next week. Never there. Yeah. And now he is here, and he doesn't do anything. She's been tweeting out some, um, going back to Emma, I know this is completely off topic. Yeah. She's been tweeting out some gobshitey things recently. Has <laughs> she? Like, um, I don't know if uh, you follow Emma on Twitter or whatever. Probably not. I think we do on the podcast one. Yeah, probably. But she's been like, oh, yeah, the four horse women, I'd have won the title way before and all this. I was like, hmm, this is interesting. Hmm. So it makes me wonder what this debut is going to be. Yeah. Is it going to be this sexy version of Emma or is it going to be some sort of swerve hmm. and this Emma's going to be some fucking badass? I hope, I hope for that, sir. Certainly. Uh, that sounds interesting. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. Uh, I don't, I mean, sexy Emma won't work on TV. Not for me. Mm. Not in this PG era. Yeah. They're going to tease this Emmalina thing for a while and then she's going to come back and kick fucking ass and that'll be awesome. That'll be awesome. Yeah. I agree. Um, sorry. Go back to SmackDown. Uh, yeah. So, Mojo Wally versus, uh, Mojo Wally versus Kurt Hawkins, uh, with some actor guy at ringside on the announced thing. I don't know. Some who? And some actor. I don't know. Didn't, didn't know who he was. Oh. Yeah. Um, and then Mojo won. So, yeah. Some actor guy. Yeah. I think it's on some sort of show that debuted that's on after SmackDown. I hate how they do that. Yeah. I have some TV crap that you're never going to watch. Yeah. I think, oh, I think Randy Orton was on it last week. That's why he's on this week. Oh, who knows? Who cares? Oh. <sighs> uh, yeah. So the main Just event. Just give us wrestling. We don't want this Exactly. Shit. Yeah. Real, real wrestling. Uh, the main event was, uh, Dolph Ziggler versus Baron Corbin. Uh, Age of Stars was at ringside. 
Uh, match ended in a double count out because of course it did. And there's going to be a triple threat next week? Yep. Double threat. <laughs> <Called it. laughs> I didn't even watch SmackDown. Uh, yeah. Uh, I saw some of the highlights, hence how I knew about Luchadora oh, yeah. and uh, some of the bits. But, uh, <sighs> yep, you totally called it. Triple threat next week. Uh, Danny Boyne came down and said, <laughs> oh, that's not how it's going to happen. It's uh, yeah. <sighs> And yeah, yeah so the McMahons have not been on TV for a few weeks. Must be their actually. Christmas break. Yeah, I guess so. Um, yeah, that's no, SmackDown. But... Sure. Wrestling. <laughs> Hooray for wrestling! Yay. <laughs> so yeah, that was that. Okay, so triple threat next week. So SmackDown is shaping up to be quite good next week. Yeah, next week could be cool. And I'm sure it'll be fine. Yeah. And they'll have some sort of Santa stuff on Raw next week, I'm sure. Yeah. So no, it'll be after Christmas. Yeah, true. I'll be, it'll only be Boxing Day, though. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe There'll be a there. food fight backstage, for sure. Yeah, there always seem to be. Yep. Yeah, thanks There'll be some well. sort of Christmassy stuff. And there's trees there this week and Braun Strowman destroyed everything. So. <laughs> yeah. Finn. Hello. This week's episode of the Sonny and Finn show. Oh, yes. Is brought to you by the letter... L. Have we done L? I don't know. I don't think I have. L. You've got L. L, okay. For Lima. Who? I don't know, Lima. Oh. Like an animal. Oh, okay. <laughs> Or Emma Lena. Uh, or Lana. Can I not alphabet? What's going on here? <laughs> A, B, C, D, E, F, G, F, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, A, B
<laughs> as the Sonny and Finn show. Yes. It's going to continue through 2017 as the Sonny and Finn show brought to you by Daydreamer Gaming. Yeah. There's uh, lots of stuff to come. So stick with us. It's going to be fun times ahead. Mm-hmm. Thank you for your support this year. Yes, thank you. It's very much appreciated. And uh, we appreciate all of you, everybody who supported us. Um, so thank you very much. Go and subscribe to our YouTube channel if you already don't. YouTube.com forward slash Sunny Finn Play. Same on Twitch. Mm-hmm. Go to iTunes and subscribe to the Sunny and Finn podcast. Go to SoundCloud and follow us on there. Or your podcast service of choice anywhere. Yep. But this has been episode 44 of the Sunny and Finn show. We are a weekly video game and wrestling podcast that posts every single Friday yes. across podcast services everywhere. Everywhere. We hope you have a very nice Christmas mm-hmm. and a great new year. Next week's show is going to be a Games of the Year podcast. We'll be back with your regular, regular, regular. scheduled, regular, around. You, you do me. <laughs> regular, <laughs> regular scheduled programming in the new year. Yes. When everything's going to be different and amazing. <laughs> but still the same. Still the same. Amazing, different and the same. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> More dick jokes. That's it. More dick jokes. More dick jokes. We promise more dick jokes for the new year. Hashtag dick jokes. (laughs) Hashtag dick jokes. (laughs) Thank you very much for listening, guys. We will see you in the new year. Yes. Take care. Goodbye. Goodbye. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas.